Earth is the only planet that contains water. Water supports the life on Earth. On Earth, water exists in many forms. Though oceans contain large amount of water, the largest sources of fresh water are the polar ice caps and snow line regions which is occupied by glaciers of the Earth. The level above which there is a perpetual snow cover is called the snow line. The snow line varies with altitude and latitude. In the polar region, it is at sea level. In East Africa, it is at 5000 meters. In the Northern Hemisphere, it is lower on the shady north facing side of a mountain than the south facing side. When the accumulation of snow in a region increases year by year, it gradually turns into ice by its own weight. Masses of ice that cover large areas of a continent are called ice sheets and those which occupy mountain valleys are called valley glaciers. Today, ice sheets occur in Antarctica and Greenland while valley glaciers are found in the Himalayas, Andes, Alps and Rockies. The period when the high latitudes were buried under ice sheets is known as the Ice Age. A glacier is defined as a mass of ice that moves under the influence of gravity along a confined causeway from its source area. However, the movement is not of the glacier as a whole. With the melting of the ice at the end of the Ice Age, enormous quantities of water were set free. Some of these formed lakes, examples being the Great Lakes of America and the lakes of Finland. Throughout the glacier, bits of ice are melting, trickling down valley and then turning back into ice the whole time. It means that within the glacier, there is a gradual down valley movement. Glacial erosion consists of two processes in the glacier. One, plucking or the tearing away of blocks of rock which have become frozen into the base and sides of a glacier.